Known to fans of the Lifetime reality show as Ms. Minnie, Ashley Ross was involved in a road collision on April 26, 2020, after losing control of her car and colliding with another vehicle. She succumbed to her injuries just a day later at Grady Memorial Hospital. A police report obtained by TMZ, which is based on eyewitness testimony and the responding officer's observation, revealed that the 34-year-old Little Woman Atlanta star briefly went off-road before abruptly swinging back to the left and colliding with another vehicle in the opposite lane near Old National Highway in Atlanta. She was reportedly found unresponsive on the scene and was deemed responsible for the wreck. Shortly after her tragic passing, rapper Slick Beats, who she had been with since late 2019, posted a tribute on his Instagram, writing, The moment I saw you, I just knew it. I realized that you are all that I have been searching for all my life. I love you today, I love you tomorrow, and I will love you the same 10 years from now. I'ma miss you, baby girl. During Ross' celebration of life, her mother, Tammy Jackson, told mourners that she got a phone call from her daughter shortly after the crash. When this happened, the accident, on April 26 at 11.11 p.m., she managed to call me and I picked up the phone. She didn't say anything, but I heard her breathing, and it gives me a little comfort knowing that she was thinking about me. Tammy relayed at the heartbreaking funeral. Little Women Atlanta premiered in January 2016 as a spin-off show of Little Women LA, and in the course of its five seasons, a lot has gone with the identical twin sisters, Amanda and Andrea Salinas. Before they joined the hit Lifetime show, the two were club dancers and performed together as the Tiny Twins. Amanda tied the knot with longtime boyfriend Jordan Castillo on August 25, 2018. The other half of the Tiny Twins, Andrea, has been in an on-again, off-again relationship with Chris Fernandez for over seven years. They are the proud parents of three children, Andre, Aubrey, and Anaya. In May of 2019, the sister duo released a song titled Project X with fellow Little Women cast members Brie Barlop and Emily Fernandez. Their music video for the song was released on YouTube in June 2019, and over the course of 16 days, the video smashed more than a million views. Tiffany Moni Cachette has been an integral member of Little Women Atlanta ever since its inception. However, in the season 5 premiere, the TV personality shocked fans when she packed her bags and left for Texas. After learning from her lawyer that she had lost in the custody battle for her son Derek Becton Jr., Moni temporarily left the franchise to move home to Houston and live closer to her 13-year-old. The 37-year-old is confirmed to be back full-time when the show returns for its sixth season this fall. As fans recall, the Lifetime alum married Moreland Ragland in 2017. The wedding was documented and aired on a Lifetime special entitled Moni Gets Married. In June 2019, Moni announced she was getting a divorce via an Instagram post, ending two years of marriage. In October 2018, Melissa Hancock, who guest starred on the second season of Little Women Atlanta, was sentenced to 16 years in prison after she pleaded guilty to involuntary manslaughter in a drunken car crash that led to the death of a 29-year-old Coast Guard petty officer, Daniel Dill. Dill was on his way to pick up his wife, who was celebrating her birthday with her friends at a bar when his 2009 Mazda was struck by Hancock, who at the time had more than twice the legal limit of alcohol in her bloodstream. Recurring guest star for several episodes of the first season, Shirlene Ms. Juicy Baby Pearson came full-time on season 2. As a reality TV star and actress, Ms. Juicy is an industry veteran, having started acting as early as age 10. Most lately, the 48-year-old was cast in a recurring role in the nail salon comedy drama, Claws. Although Ms. Juicy came to fame by being an iconic pot stirrer on the Lifetime hit, it was her unique voice on the popular radio show The Ricky Smiley that led her to pursue reality TV on a more serious level. In January 2020, the reality star took to social media to announce her departure from the syndicated radio show, allegedly because she was not offered a contract renewal for the year 2020. Before Emily Fernandez and Brianna Barlup were on Little Women Atlanta, they worked as club dancers. Following the show's first season, the duo, known as The Cheeks, moved to Dallas and joined the cast of Little Women Dallas. They returned to Little Women Atlanta during its fifth season. While Brianna is expected to make recurring appearances, Emily will not be returning for the show's upcoming season. 
In fall 2019, Brie reportedly stopped speaking to Emily in an Instagram live video by Cordero Wuda Bowen, who happens to be the father of Brie's kids Malik and Carter. It was revealed that Brie woke up one morning and decided that she didn't want to be friends with Emily anymore. A guest star on two episodes of season two, Tanya Scott joined the cast on season three and remained with the program for the next two seasons. The 26-year-old is the mother of three children, Jaden, Luna, and Tahiri. Abira Green had a recurring role on the reality TV program during seasons three, four, and five. In early 2020, it was announced that Abira has been promoted to series regular for the sixth season of Little Women Atlanta. She has four children, Jasper, Turbira, Jay Henry, and Phoebe. In the summer of 2018, Abira dated rapper Bumpman. Samantha Ortiz first appeared on Little Women Atlanta on a season two episode and then joined the main cast of the series for its fourth season. She announced her exit from the show just before the season five premiere. Thank you for watching our video. Don't forget to like, share, and comment. Subscribe to our channel for more great content.